Big thank you to Sneak Flat and Super Rare Originals for providing a key to Tiny Terry's Turbo Trip through Game 2. Tiny Terry's Turbo Trip is currently available on Steam. It's a chaotic but cozy game where you play as Terry who wants to launch himself into space using his new car. Doing something this cool and reckless will surely make him the talk of the town. Run, drive, and glide through this small journey of big discoveries as Terry works towards achieving his goal. This game is super unique. It's an absolute ton of fun. I found myself smiling from ear to ear and laughing out loud while playing the game and just genuinely enjoying my time in Sprinklewater, the world where Terry lives. You help Terry find turbo junk all over Sprinklewater, whether you get it from NPCs or you find it just laying around, and you use this turbo junk to help upgrade Terry's vehicle so he can go to space. The map is small, but doesn't feel small while you're running around in it, as there's just an absolute ton of NPCs that are hilarious that you can meet, as well as lots of really interesting points on the map for you to go to, like locations, or maybe even your jump nemesis might be rolling around, you might just come across them. There are lots of locations, including shops, where you can get different items that can help you do traversal around the world or can make you just look super stylish. So whether you're running around with a pipe in your hand robbing people, which is, you know, kind of my favorite thing, do it for some extra coin, or driving around town to your next destination is an absolute blast. I really, really love the world that the devs built and all the characters in Terry's life, especially Terry himself. Don't get me started on this soundtrack. It is so fun and just genuinely every time I load up the game and I just start hearing music for it, it just makes me so happy. Like it puts me in a good mood. So good. I did a live stream on this channel of the game. So if you want to go ahead and check that out, it is on the channel now. It's about the first two hours of the game. People said it was kind of like a cozy GTA in the chat. I've never played GTA before, but that's what they're saying. So maybe if you've played it, you know what they're they're saying. But they really, really enjoyed this game. Those were here, who were here live um, really loved it. Because the game is available on Steam, it's also available on Steam Deck and is actually verified. Right out the gate of release, it was verified. I did some testing and found that the default settings in handheld mode were a little bit taxing on my battery and my fan, so I did some changing in-game settings. I just changed it to medium, and then um, I just basically changed the actual um, frame rate to 45, and then it was really stable, and it was just more what I like when I'm traveling with the Steam Deck. But when it is plugged in to a TV, for example, I got some recordings of it here on my computer, um, it ran pretty much fine from 60 frames to 55 frames and didn't drop too much unless you were in a place where it would be more populated even though I had the crowd turned down um the frames dropped a little but it wasn't super noticeable when I was playing like on a tv or on my computer here just to catch some footage so so it was interesting but I mean there's a lot of ways you can play and it's not like it worked super bad like as soon as I opened it up it's just what I personally like in my handheld experience is not to have my battery run out too quickly I get you know battery anxiety about it running out when I'm out um, even though I have an extra one that like hooks onto the back it still gives me stress I'm like man this thing is gonna die if I'm playing it in the car or something so if that's something that you kind of get stressed out about, turning the settings down a bit doesn't make the game look bad or anything. It's, it runs great. So 45 is a great mid ground for me and it kept my battery alive a lot longer. Um, so, and my fan a lot lower. So that's why I went that way. But otherwise, if you don't mind that, you can just play it right out the gate. So now I can take Terry everywhere I go. I have not completed Tiny Terry's Turbo Trip yet, but I've really, really enjoyed my time with it so far and hope to jump back in, honestly, as soon as this video is done, like I'm not, I love this game. This game is definitely going on my favorite games of the year list. Like I already know it's, it's so unique and fun and I just, it's right. It's the right vibe for me. Like I just love it. Thank you so much to everyone for watching this video and watching me cover Tiny Terry's Turbo Trip. I am so, so thankful I was able to get a key for this game so I could cover it. I was honestly going to get this game anyway because it's just so incredible and it's just so cool. I'm probably going to buy it for my brother because he really wants to get it because um, it looks so much fun. Like my sister wants to play it too. It's just such an awesome game and I'm so glad I was able to cover it. And a big shout out again and thank you to Sneak Flat, Super Rare Original, and Game Tomb. I really, really appreciate the support. Let me know if you're going to check out the game. All the links are down below as usual. They're not affiliate links. I'll always let you know if they are, but still check it out because this game is amazing. Throw it on your wish list. Check it out. It's really, really great. I haven't heard anything about it coming to consoles, but you never know. And I appreciate all your support 
for this channel. Also, really quick announcement, I am an official co-streamer for the Wholesome Direct taking place June 8th at 12 p.m. Eastern. You can set your reminders right now. That stream is already up, so you can go ahead and get notified when I go live. I will remind you again later in the week, and today there's probably a little reminder to let you guys know. I did announce this on my stream, but I know not everyone sees the stream, so I wanted to make sure I let you guys know, and... I'm excited. Very exciting to be an official co-streamer. I love the Wholesome Direct. I buy a shirt every year. I watch it every year anyway. So it's really awesome to get to be a part of it in this way. Um, and yeah, so definitely be there if you want to hear about over 70 cozy games and wholesome games coming out. Like, that's a lot of games. Thank you so much for watching. Remember to stay safe, hug your loved ones. See y'all next time. Bye.